Well, we've just finished up two days of training at uh, Henderson's and Super Steer and the Motorhome Steering and Suspension Institute. And one of the things we talked about was the importance of analyzing the weight distribution and overhang ratios. And when you know it, right out of the gate, uh, Monday morning, we had a coach in here that had a 76% overhang ratio and the average diesel pusher is 50%. And the weight ratio, 6,250 divided by 16,400 gives us a 38% weight ratio. And our baseline that we like to see is 50%. That translates into about 2,000 pounds lighter than we would like to see it on the front of that motorhome. This motorhome was literally dangerous to drive before the customer put on a set of tiger tracks and a set of coney shocks. Now I drove it today on the road performance assessment and it still was not any fun at all to drive. It had a tendency to uh, uh, porpoise and it also had a tendency to uh, bump steer. When you hit a bump, the steering wheel changed position and it had a real poor returnability. I would not want my wife to drive it, I'll put it to you that way. It's so light on the front end, so the customer is going to go home and he's a mechanic, retired mechanic, he's going to do some of the work himself. But this is one thing I want to emphasize to all the students that will be seeing this, that there is a reason why we do this. You do not want admin expectations. If you would have just started putting parts on this motorhome without taking the time to analyze it, your customer would not be very satisfied and would probably be frustrated with you as a uh, technician and as a repair facility. So we, once again, we want to emphasize the importance of doing a proper road performance assessment before any work begins on a vehicle. Thank you for attending our school, and I just look forward to seeing you at another school coming up soon. Thank you.